Shalom Kaverim. In this segment called Hope in the Face of Isolation, I'd like to share with you two poems that I created myself about coming back and connecting. The first one is called Anew. I always knew that I could be flying to the tallest tree, floating far and soaring high. Yes, I am a butterfly. I spread my wings, the orange glows. I touch a tulip and a rose. They may grow because I'm here, blooming yet another year. I hardly remember when the earth was my only friend, eating dirt, my belly sore, longing still for something more. And so I hid, enveloped in my cocoon, eyes closed, resting, waiting, sleeping, healing, dreaming. Remembering the past while looking ahead, rubbing my eyes, I crawl from my bed. I took a little jump but fell and thought I slid to a deep, dark well, almost unsure of what to do, holding hope that my dream is true. No one can tell me why it takes time to learn to fly, but here I am near the stars, careful not to trip on Mars. And if I fall, I'll rise again, shake my wings and find a friend, for living life is one big try since I became a butterfly. The second poem I call Boomerang. The wind is blowing through the trees, nourishing and feeding my soul. Cool and calm as a summer's breeze, blowing me to a place that is whole. Looking and listening to pockets of folk, islands of laughter and glee away from the crowd. I can't get the joke, but don't take it personally. It was a long time ago that I wandered around, singing to myself in the wood. I saw a lost child, now suddenly found, who said to me, yeah, that sounds kind of good. If you like that one, I said to my friend, would you like to hear another? And we sang and told stories without any end. I now had a new little brother. I found many more tales since that day long since past, but none have felt quite as free as the day I found the courage to ask, little boy, want to listen to me? Now I see many wanderers and hear all their pleas trying to figure out spirit. Just sit still for a minute with the wind and the trees, and I promise you, friends, that you'll hear it. My friends, as we may feel despair, there's always times and ways to grow out of it and connect with each other. 